Well, hello everyone. My name is Christine Bonjavani Stiff, and today is the first workday of 2019. So happy new year to everyone. And I am talking about anxiety today because I just had, I believe, five days off of work, spent some time with my family and committed to doing no work. Now, I did think about some things with work. I let my brain do some exploring, but I wasn't thinking about tasks and what needed to get done and no social media, which was amazing. But this morning before my alarm went off, my brain just decided, decided to go a little crazy. And it started thinking about all of the things I needed to do. It was just like this the floodgates were closed and they were like burst open with all of these negative thoughts. And I started to feel it a little bit in my solar plexus and it just didn't feel good. But I'm going to tell you what I did because, and then I'm going to explain what I want you to try to do. So what I did is I let it happen to me for a little bit before I really started to recognize it. And it's amazing how fast it ramps up. It is literally like the more you think about it, it's one of those indulgent emotions. So the more you let it happen, the worse it gets. And it just escalates into this big thing. But then I started to say, okay, this is going to be a little experiment. So I started to think about what was happening, like how I felt, how the emotion was feeling in my body. And I thought about some real stuff about how, you know, of course the thoughts going in my mind is you haven't done anything for five days, everything is catching up with you, now you have a ton of stuff to do, you're never gonna get it done, how is this, how can you ever be successful? And I just started to listen to it and let my brain do its thing. And then I started to just come up with replies to what it was saying that, Yes, I took time off and I deserve it. And now is a day, today is a day I'm going to work and I will logically sit down and look at my calendar, think about what needs to get done, review it and just get to work. And what happens is it just goes away. You don't entertain it and that's what happens is it goes away. Now it's not that it doesn't come back again because it's kind of tried to budge in today, but so what I want to say to you is to, to know, first of all, that it's just an emotion. It's something going on in your brain, right? And what is happening is your brain is starting to create a vibration in your body. And it's just letting you know that something is going on in here. And what I want you to start doing instead of just letting it happen to you, I want you to start paying attention to what's going on. Like, what does this feel like? What is your brain doing all of a sudden? Um, and just being able to sit back on the outside and be the watcher. It allows you to start to understand your brain and help to prevent it from getting worse because you're reducing your total amount of suffering by thinking about it, not allowing it to just happen. The other thing you could do, which is what I used to do, and this is a process, it's not something that you just wake up and can do, but you can avoid it. And that's what I used to do. I used to just like force it down, like make myself get up, make myself get going and just be a crazy hot mess. And what that does is it just compounds the pain. You know, there are so many things that you um, can do when we're afraid of that sensation, when we feel it, we when and we want to avoid, we might eat, we might drink, we might well, hopefully we won't start drinking right when you wake up, but can happen, right? Um, you give up, 
Like I could totally have just let this control my day and not gotten anything done. And um, so that's what I want you to think about is this is just an emotion. The best thing, the next thing I did after I went and worked out and um, came back and had my quiet time with God. And then I just did a thought download. I, for 10 minutes, just wrote everything my brain was telling me, how I was a loser. And then I looked at it. It did a thought model on it and unintentional what my brain was doing. My brain was just doing what it's wired to do. I just took five days off. Oh my gosh, the world is going to come to an end. I'm never going to succeed. It's what our brain does. But what we have to do is just re-teach our brain. It's okay. I'm going to work today. I'm going to get my stuff done. And so I did an unintentional model on one of those crazy thoughts I was thinking. And then I did an intentional model, which helped me to just really think about how I wanted this day to go and how I'm going to need to feel to be able to think like that and the actions I'll take and then the result I will get. And so I wanna wish you all a very happy beginning to 2019. We are gonna rock this year. And if you have any questions about anxiety, I would love to talk to you about them. So send me some of your questions.